if you've ever used uh, the drawing tool uh, in NinjaTrader, the ruler, maybe you noticed you can't display both the price change and the percent change at the same time. So you manually have to edit each ruler each time to toggle back and forth. Um, with the NinjaTrader algo add-on ruler, uh, this problem is solved. And you can display points, percent, the number of ticks. This is all displayed by default. You also get the number of bars between the two points, as well as that in terms of actual days. Um, you know, so the difference would be there'd be weekends in between the two. Um, and another very useful um, piece of information that this ruler displays is it takes the, the percent change divided by the average true range of the last 14 days. So th this puts it in perspective, you know, and this is especially useful for historical analysis. So let's, I got two series here. We got, we got a continuous series of wheat um, all the way up until today. And then we have just the 1973 contract of wheat. Now, if I were to measure from July until mid-September of 1973, you'll see that uh, the ruler shows that it was only 14%. However, if you actually look at the contract not adjusted, just the 1973 December contract, and you measure that same distance, you will notice that the price difference was actually 113%. So a, a way to kind of uh, get around for this issue would be to also look at the daily ATR. Um, so if you compare the difference between these two in terms of daily ATR, one is 12.7 and one is 13.6. So those are way closer in line than uh, basically being 100% off. So if you're analyzing historical periods, the, uh, the daily ATR value that is added to the ruler uh, display is very helpful. Um, thank you for watching, and you can purchase this product at NinjaTraderAlgos.com.